guys, um, I'm just showing you kind of like this chocolate bar stuff that I made. So what I did is I took a piece of cardboard and first of all I wrapped it in like part of it in duct tape. Basically it was an accidental way. What I was making here was a pillow, but I accidentally had a lot of duct tape left over and I didn't want to get more duct tape. And then I remembered um my party staff making some videos on like like sweets and treats for your doll slash OPS and I saw them make a chocolate bar but I forget how they made it but yeah and I'm like oh maybe I can make this into a chocolate bar so what I did is first of all I cut it like a bite had been taken out of it and then I just colored it brown so yeah basically that's that one and then the second one I made on purpose and basically what it is is like a sticker one, a sticker chocolate bar, that I just made it look like um, somebody had eaten most of it, like it was up to here and then somebody ate it. So this is like fun size and this is like full size. You know, like over here I picked my candy bowls from Halloween. I have, um, okay, so I got full size M&Ms. And I got it. fun size of them. So, comparison. That's what that is. Let me show you. This one's actually thinner than this one, I'd say. Yeah. It's thinner. But, you know, everybody makes mistakes. Actually, they're about the same size, though. So. Yeah. But, yeah, so. Um, I hope that you like this and I hope you can make your own chocolate bars too. So um yeah. And now I'm pretty much out of cardboard because I recently made this doll bed which used cardboard on the legs and yeah I had a really big piece of cardboard but I just ran out of it. So see you later and I hope this like kinda gave you inspiration or whatever. Like my froggy stuff did to me or help do you think of your own idea like give you inspiration or I hope you make this for yourself so yeah thank you for watching this and see you later